Myasthenia gravis, what is this? It's an autoimmune disorder where our own body attacks the acetylcholine receptors. Whoa, what does that mean? Well, let's think about this. Acetylcholine is a neurotransmitter that helps activate different muscles. So if I'm destroying, my body's destroying the receptors where acetylcholine goes and activates muscles, let's think about the signs and symptoms that can occur because of that. The first one is think about all the things that you're naturally using that are muscles that you don't even realize. How about blinking? How about focusing and unfocusing just when you're looking at things? How about breathing? How about swallowing? So you look at the signs and symptoms and all of those over time as those receptors are being destroyed are going to start to get fatigued. So am I going to start to get droopy eyes? I will. Am I going to start to develop diplopia and or have blurry vision? Absolutely. Am I worried about respiratory issues? Yeah, because I'm constantly breathing, talking, slurred speech, dysphagia, trouble swallowing. Absolutely. All these things because we're using them constantly amongst other things because our body is destroying those acetylcholine receptors and we're unable to activate muscles. What else do we need to know? Well, it's an autoimmune disease. So what are we going to do to suppress our immune system? Immunosuppressants. What are we going to teach about immunosuppressants? Always educate your patients about signs and symptoms of infection. That sore throat, that gastroenteritis, that UTI, they're not normal in a patient taking immunosuppressants. So make sure you educate, educate, educate.